Hey guys, it's Eric Barfield. Today I'm going to show you just a real fast tutorial of how I work with large number of songs in a set in order to get them in the right order and to set them up for a uh, show. So uh, this is specifically dealing with the cover band collection. In the cover band collection there are over 250 patches and any given week i'll be playing some combination of around 40 to 70 of those songs and um, i'm just going to show you real quick using the nord sound manager how we can put together a list in a way that's quick and efficient and just goes right through the set in a smart way and not take you forever to assemble so here we go okay guys so i'm going to just do this real quickly there's two things that i brought up um, on this on the right here I have my set that I've gotten from my very capable band leader and downtown band for the week and on the left I have loaded in all of the patches from the cover band collection and yeah there everything's here I've already kind of gotten started on these um, but I'll show you the process of how I do it in order to get it to look this way um, you have to do a couple things. I'm going to come back over here for a second. And there are two things that you have to do in order to be able to make this work. So the first one is I use the key command shortcut command O to make it so that you can not only see all of the patches that are here, but you can also see all of the gaps. So all of the gaps up here and then the other thing that's nice here is you can select name and you can arrange all your stuff by name here which is really handy um, you can also do version and category I'm or location I'm gonna just be using the name for today so that's the first step you want to hit command O so you can see all of your spaces here so I'll hit command O again and then hit this back to location and okay we'll go like that and hit command o and there's all my spaces and again i've already started putting together a set list now here's the second and most important thing if you can hit command l it's going to give you a second column so that you can drag from one column to the next so once i've done that what i'll do is i'll come over to my set list up here and by the way, I have my Nord Stage 3 down here connected via USB cable. When I come back over here, what I'm going to do is find what's next in the set, like Uptown Funk is next here, right after Play That Funky Music. Um, or I'm sorry, actually, it's going to be hard to handle by the Black Crows. Um, what I do, there's a little search option up here which is so nice and I just start writing in um, H A R D hard and that's all I need in order to find the title and if I needed more than that I could just keep writing with no spaces hard to and you can see so like for instance on if I start off with I it brings up all the things with I W though puts it down to I want wish and there we go so let's go back here to hard to handle grab this drag it and drop it and now it's in order and I just keep doing this for all the songs and it actually goes surprisingly quick so I might do like sugar next grab and drag and drop and I'm done and I can put a set list together like this with about 50 or 60 songs in less than 10 minutes and then the great thing is when I come down here if I go to my list go all the way back here under numbers all the way to the start um, you can see that I just click through and I have all my songs in the order that I want them and I can also see kind of a set list view right here by holding down shift and just turning this here like this, which is so handy. I really need a set list for this reason. Also, I'll make adjustments if we change the keys on anything. 
And that's as easy as just hitting Command Store. Scrolling forward here, and then holding down this and selecting whatever key I wanna do. So yeah, that's pretty much the whole tutorial. If you have any questions, let me know. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Thanks.